Today, we take you to meet Michael Vincent Manalo, a Filipino artist based in Taiwan. He moved to Taiwan 10 years ago and has experimented with a wide range of art mediums and won several awards. He said his artistic journey was full of hardship, but he chose to preserve and hopes to encourage others to do the same. FTV reporter Stephanie Yang caught up with Manalo at his latest exhibition to learn more about his career. Michael Vincent Manalo explains his artwork series Chasing Dreams. This painting was inspired by his art residency in Poland. Just like unexpected moments or the painting utilizes augmented reality. After visitors download an app and swipe the QR code, the painting is presented on their mobile phone through animation or video. The AR video represents, like sometimes we have these kind of moments where we're not so sure about ourselves. Like we don't really, we're not so sure about the path that we took is correct or not. So the video that I showed earlier is kind of showing that doubt or anxiety or sometimes like those those moments when we think that like you feel like you're lost. I uh, used the same painting and just animated it. Yeah, so I just made the camera move, like move back and then put like two images together, like to make it more like a, like a kaleidoscope, like just viewing, looking through your soul, through yourself. This work was inspired by the beach in Jingsui, Taichung. Manalo drew these images when he was living in Taichung. Through these works, he hopes to remind viewers to chase their dreams and cherish the simple moments in their everyday lives. Most of my work is about memory and um, like nostalgia. So I always look back from where I came from. So and there was a time in like a few years ago when I was living in the in Taichung, like somewhere in Qingshui. It's near the uh, like near the near, near the beach. So. I always ride my bike or ride a scooter near the beach, and for me at that time it was just an ordinary moment, just a normal moment. But then when I look at back, look back at it now, I feel like that that was like a it was like a golden time for chasing dreams. For me, like everybody has their own dream, but then some people give up on it. I think because like there's so many ways, I many factors that's why they give up. But then I still believe that. You know, like, why would you, why would you give up on your dream? You only have like one life. If you, you know, if you get to the age of being old and you're at the, on your deathbed, you will probably, you will probably regret not at least trying to chase your dream. So, I think for me, at least just try, because I was there before. I was, I wanted to chase my dream, but it was not always so smooth. But then, at least I tried. You know? Manalo is a painter and photographer from the Philippines who is now based in Taiwan. He first came to Taiwan 10 years ago. He specializes in photo manipulation and installations. His works are greatly inspired by the imagined and real memories of nostalgic and dreamlike environments. Manalo started his career as a digital painter, but due to the lack of demand for album and book covers during COVID, he started acrylic painting. I used to do digital painting before for my work. I do um, graphic design and also a lot of works for publications for books, for example, and CD covers, album covers for bands. And then when COVID started, because like, you know, everything was not so like money wise, you know, there was no album covers, no book covers. So there was nothing for me to do. So I decided I'm just going to try my skill in painting. I'll see if I, if I can actually paint you know, on a canvas. I'm trying to do, you know, do my best to make a name for myself in Taiwan. Manalo hopes to continue to chase his dreams and encourage others to do so. He is now showcasing his works at the studio till November 11th. FTV reporter Stephanie Yang and Hu Chong-en in Taipei.